not occasionally. No. Nope. All right. All right, what we have here is a oscillating sluice box. This thing kind of shakes back and forth. The material goes out and it drops right out here in this middle area right there, right down into the sluice box. Um, kind of like a pan that just drops down in there. Yeah, yeah water nice little belly. There. There's some water jets in the back. Some what? Water jets at the back shooting the oh, water. Okay. Yeah. Of course, you've got, right down the middle, of course, you've got a large uh, pipe going down the middle that's got holes in it that are shooting water into the material that's rolling around in here. That's washing and breaking up all the material. Uh, you can see that pipe running right down the middle there. Uh, typically when you're rolling material, if it's rolling uh, that direction away from us, you would have a, a pile of material from, oh, let's see, that would be 6 o'clock to about whatever that is, Nine. 2 o'clock, or on the other Three. side. Three. Depending on which direction you're looking at the barrel, you got a, like a, from 5 o'clock to 9 o'clock. Material comes up and it falls down. It falls down. The other side of the trommel doesn't have a thing on it. So, uh, but you're spraying water into that constantly. The fines, half inch or less, drops out and goes on the sluice box right here. You've got uh, some riffles here. We're gonna do a little modification on that for the for the uh, fabricator. We need to add at least one bar across here without bars in them. These uh, kind of act like Hungarian riffles, but unfortunately these are constructed with a bar there and they negate the... Fred Duckwater Hart, the rugged whitewater gold miner who appeared on Discovery's Araska Set docuseries Gold Wash, Wild Water, has died. He was 80 years old. Hart's family announced his death Monday with a statement posted on his official Facebook page. He died Monday surrounded by family after battling stage 4 brain cancer. Four months after he announced his diagnosis, he had marked his 80th birthday on Sunday. He fought courageously in his battle against cancer. Fred touched many lives and we loved and supported by many. The statement said, the fan favorite started his gold mining career in North Dakota building a family legacy before co-starring in Gold Rush, South America, Gold Rush, The Legend of Porcupine, Greek, and the spin-off series Gold Rush, White Water with his son, veteran miner Dustin Hart. The White Water series, which premiered in 2018 and is among several in the network's gold mining franchise, is set high in Alaska's remote Chikat Mountains and follows White Water gold seekers, divers, and mountaineers in their pursuit of millions in gold. In season 6, Dustin had the opportunity to buy his father's mining equipment and run to cruise simultaneously for the first time. Discovery was deeply saddened to learn of Fred Hart's passing. He was a treasured member of the Gold Rush family and we share our condolences with his family and all those who loved him. The capable network said Thursday in a statement to the Times. May he so rest in peace and thank you so much for watching.